kind of just woke up maybe like 30 minutes ago and it is Tuesday it is June 22nd it's kind of gloomy today so I need to go to Target and buy food for the week I need food for today so Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday I don't normally cook on Fridays but since we ate out yesterday on Monday, I'm just going to cook on, fr on Friday. So this is a list of things that I have to get. This is actually a recipe for a churro, ke for a churro cheesecake that I made. But this is my list for Target. So we need creamer, baking soda, vinegar, sugar, bathroom spray. Actually, I already got sugar. Um, I need the Glade plugins, toothpicks, floss, paper plates slash cups, shampoo for me, Tostitos, ice cream for Jay, and then Jay needs um, shower gels from Bath and Body Works. So this is a maybe. I might go today. I don't know. And then under Costco, I don't have anything. But uh, I feel like I could get the Tostitos at Costco. And I could get... Because um, none of this is like food for me to cook. So I still have to figure out what I want to cook this week. I'm thinking about buying like chicken thighs. And so maybe Costco would be good to buy chicken. Uh, Jay already vacuumed in here, so probably just going to give it one more vacuum so I can mop um, everywhere. And then I'm actually doing laundry right now. So I washed all the towels. So I saw this hack on TikTok where you um obviously you put your detergent in here so i'm gonna put some so you just leave the cup in the washer and like let it wash with the clothes so then you don't have to like rinse the cup and you don't end up with all this buildup of like soap or detergent in here so every time you wash you just throw the cup in there and yeah like it'll just clean the cup for you so you're so you always end up with a clean cup so this is currently the downy that i use and i really really like it but the other day we were in costco and I saw this one and this was like eight dollars and I feel like that downy one the other downy one it was also around that price and it's so much smaller so the other downy one this one so this one has 2.4 liters 81 ounces and this and this one has 5.55 53 liters 187 ounces and it's like the same price and it says it's lavender too so I haven't tried it yet because I'm trying to finish the downy one first but yeah I guess we'll see how that goes so a new season of elite came out but I want to watch that when I'm sitting down and like paying attention because I love this show so much. So I'm not going to play that just yet. But I guess for now, I'll just watch a YouTube video. Um, What can I play? Um, I guess we'll watch a little bit of a tea. 
really upset for a really long time over Jake and they stayed friends for a very long time but it's been made clear as of recent that the two of them are no longer on good terms it seems since Hannah did not go to his last fight and was shading Jake a lot while on a trip instead of going to Jake's fight and supporting him. In the comments down below i love you guys so so much i hope you guys are having a great beginning of your week and i will talk to you guys in the next video bye guys <laughs>
So one of my sides is already used, so I'm just going to flip it and use the other side. And then when you've used both sides, you just take it off and you throw it in the washer. And that's how you clean it. I'll just put like a little bit of detergent and a little bit of bleach and that's how I clean them. So it'll take 30 seconds to uh, get hot. And that side is the side that I already used. That's why it looks dirty. So I'm just, the back side, the one that I'm using right now is the clean one. You basically, you pump it so that the steam comes out and then you just start mopping in areas where it's like really dirty like right here by the door or like in the bathroom or the kitchen I will go over it multiple times just to make sure it's like actually clean and I'll normally mop under the rug too but it's kind of hard to do that right now because I'm recording and mopping at the same time guys I am sweating okay so I'm just gonna finish mopping the hall and the bathroom and I'm gonna change into my workout clothes and I'll see you guys in a bit. So this is my outfit for the gym. It is Gymshark. It's the sports bra with the leggings. And then this is what the back looks like. It has like the matching logo in the back. Oh my God, I got so sunburned. I look so dark. And you can see the outline of my swimsuit. That's funny. Hey guys, so I just got back from the gym. Uh, I'm just gonna drink my protein. And, and when I got home, I had a package at the door. So let's see what it is. I have like a couple things that I'm waiting for. So let's see which one this is. So I ordered my foundation. Is it the right color? Yeah. So I don't know if you guys know, but they're discontinuing this um, foundation, which is the Too Faced Peach Perfect. It was like the beginning of the mall's reopening and a lot of stuff in Sephora was on sale. Well, apparently all that stuff that was on sale is like, getting discontinued that's why like they were just trying to get rid of it and a lot of the peach perfect line from Too Faced was on sale and quitting this foundation and so every time I went to Sephora I couldn't find my color like they only have like four colors left and so the last time I bought it I had to buy it directly on the Too Faced website which they also have it on sale on their website and then this time, uh, I had to buy it again. And I went on the Too Faced website and they have like three colors left of it. So I'm pretty sure they're completely discontinuing it. Like even Too Faced is gonna stop selling it. So I ended up finding this on Amazon. Like someone was just selling one in my color. So I ended up buying it and like, it's just crazy that this is probably like the last time I'm going to be able to use this foundation because it was so hard to find it this time. And it sucks because I love this foundation. It's the best foundation. I've used this for since it came out. So it's been like two, three years now that I've been using it. And I love it because it really is matte. Like it doesn't make your face oily at all. This will make it through like all types of like hot weather like you will not sweat through this or get oily through this but yeah that sucks i'm gonna have to make 
that one bottle last like my old one that I'm still using I had to like cut it with scissors and I've been like scooping out with, like the left whatever's left inside the tube so like I'm really really trying to make it last so I I was telling you guys on my last video that I don't like my protein and I did get uh, I did get a couple girls that messaged me and told me or recommended like a, another vegan foundation <laughs> another vegan protein so I'm gonna give those a try but I just want to finish this one first before I buy another one and so for my protein I like putting the water in the cup first because I've noticed that when I put the powder first, the powder gets stuck to the cup. So I put the water in first, and then I'm gonna put the scoop of, of the protein. And then I just bought the super greens, like maybe, I got them like last Wednesday, so it's probably been like a week now. And I just uh, mix them with my protein. And I got these from this girl that I follow on Instagram. And uh, she's always talking about them. So I tried them out. I got the berry flavor. And it has so many good ingredients. Like everything's organic. And it has a bunch of um, uh, like vegetables. Uh, and it has like flax seed and spirulina, chlorella, uh, barley grass, wheat grass, green tea, alfalfa, like all this stuff, spinach, cauliflower, kale. And then it has like a couple of fruits in it too, which is which I think is what makes it taste good. So I've been blending this with my protein and honestly I just, it doesn't taste bad, but I usually just chug my protein like super quick. So I'm just gonna blend this. I just put on this little crop top and I tied a flannel and I'm wearing sandals and then this is my bag uh, but yeah I'm still not wearing makeup and I just put some earrings on and I'm just gonna be wearing some glasses I am back from Costco, Target, and oh my god, I am drenched in sweat. I just turned the AC on right now. But let me show you guys real quick what I got. So in Costco, I got chicken thighs, and I'm just going to freeze those because it does come with a lot. It's like six packs. And then I like to get these at Costco because it's the um only 70 calories per tortilla and it comes with like two packs so it's like 16 tortillas for five dollars and like at target one pack is around five dollars so you basically get like a whole pack free and then i got this tilapia which i need to put in the freezer i got these for jay he likes eating these with his coffee and then I just got that for Jay because it's a, uh, it's it was three of them for six dollars. So I thought that was better deal than Bath and Body Works. And then I got these for Jay. He likes eating those a lot. So these were from Target. They were two for seven. 
And then at Costco, I got turkey breast. So I like doing uh, turkey wraps with the tortillas for our lunch at work. And then I just got mandarins, bananas, and the grapes. And then in Target, I got uh, I got this one just to make a jar of to make a jar of lemonade. I was looking at the ingredients and they're pretty like simple ingredients, so I'm gonna try that out. And then I got this salad. It's the avocado toast salad, and it comes with like the avocado uh, dressing. It's like in there. You can't really see it, but. Yeah, I can eat that on the side of like the um, tilapia that I got. So I can have tilapia in the salad or chicken thighs in the salad, you know. And then I just got some floss. I got more um, cheese. So I got two of these roasted chicken and two of these Spanish style rice. And then I just got the Colby Jack cheese. Uh, I got this creamer for Jay for his coffee. And I got this shampoo. I saw it on a TikTok. So it says it's for to repair and restore life to damaged, stressed out hair. So I'm going to try it out. I already used a body wash of this brand and I really like it. So we'll try that out. And I got some of these this is my favorite scent and I have them throughout the house so I'm always buying those and then I just got another one of these for the bathroom this is the same smell as uh, these that I get I like to have my whole house just smell the same I don't like mixing different scents everywhere and then I just got this. I just thought I would try it. Um, I don't really get salsas like this, but I thought it would like be good with like the um, fish that we got or like the chicken thighs. And then I just got two cans of these refried beans. I saw them as I was leaving and I don't know. I just thought it would be like a good side. And then last but not least, I just got this uh, little pack of uh, kitchen towels it's like three dollars and i just like that they were black so i'm just gonna have these in my kitchen but yeah so i'm just gonna put all this away and i'm gonna shower and i'll see you guys after i also got um some other stuff that i put in the freezer already so i got these they're just frozen shrimp and then I got these roasted potatoes. Uh, it comes with salt, onion, garlic, parsley, red pepper seasoning, and dried green bell pepper seasoning. And then uh, I just got. And then I just got these for Jay. Organic vanilla bean uh, sandwiches. So I just got those for Jay, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm just going to put everything away. Hey guys, so I just finished cooking, and this is what I ended up making. So I made the chicken thighs, and I just seasoned them with mustard, uh, paprika, cayenne pepper, garlic, and onion, and pepper. And then uh, I just have the roasted chicken rice that I showed you guys. And then these are the roasted potatoes from Costco. And then this is just like a chopped um, salad kit from Target. It's like an avocado uh, salad. But yeah, that's how it all came out. And then I uh, did this lemonade from the one that I bought from Target. And it tastes pretty good. So we're just going to have dinner now. And I'll see you guys in a bit. Hi guys, it's Friday, June 25. And it is a few days later from the last time I vlogged. So right now I am with Jay and we are on our way to the movies. So I saw a TikTok of a movie place called 
called Cinnabar and it's in Palace Station and it's uh it's those type of movie theaters where the seats recline and there's like a food service like they have a whole menu and you can order food and there's a waiter that comes and takes your order while you're sitting down and the cool part is that the tickets are only nine dollars so no matter the time or the day they're nine dollars we are on our way right now because we got tickets for uh 6 30 to watch yeah to watch fast and the furious nine i guess i'm really excited we haven't gone to the movies in over a year now since before the pandemic we kind of got used to not going to the movies so like even when the movies did open we still uh haven't gone back and it's weird because we used to really love going to the movies like that was like when we would go out it would be to the movies so it's kind of cool that we're going back you can see palace station there and you can see the cinnabar over there Whoa, look at this guy. Looking for new movies? Then follow me. They call me Dr. Explore. We just got out of the movies. And it's so cool because the strip is right there. You can see Circus Circus. The new uh, resort world, I think it's called. And Palazzo's over there. The wind. The stratosphere. Hi guys, it is Saturday, June 26th, and we are currently in our home. So we came to see our house, uh, like the progress on it, and uh, it has so much already, like it has both floors uh, built. So I am currently standing in it right now. It has like all the wood up. So let me flip the camera and I'll kind of like guide you guys. So this is where the front door is and then the stairs are here and then this is gonna be our kitchen that uh this like beam in the middle I guess is like the island and then those are our doors to our backyard and this is what the backyard looks like it's a pretty like big size it's Bigger than we thought it was going to be. And then this is going to be like the living room area. So that um, wall in the middle, that's where our TV is going to be. And then there's two windows on each side. And then another window there. This is another window. And the sink is going to be here. And then this is all like the kitchen wall. And then this is the pantry right here. This is going to be the powder room. So this is like the door to go in there. And then this is the little closet underneath the stairs. And then this is the door to the garage. So the garage is also really big. It's a lot bigger than we thought. There's going to be a window there. And then a window on this side. And then there's uh, this side door to exit through the side of the house. But yeah, it's so cool, guys, seeing like the progress. And then, like I said, the stairs are right here. 
but we're too scared to go upstairs so we're not gonna go up but yeah it's crazy and then from back here uh you can see like the back of the house so this is what it looks like and then up there that's gonna be our master bedroom so it's gonna have two windows and then the bathroom will be right there the master bath and yeah these are like the rest of the houses it's gonna be four houses on this street that how that very first house is like maybe three weeks ahead of us and then these two are probably like two weeks and then it's us but yeah guys it's so exciting they said that our house will be ready like mid-september but we think it might be ready sooner maybe because it's going really fast there was like three weeks where nothing was happening and like I even told our realtor because they were working on the rest of the houses but nothing was done in our house but um literally the week that I told her we got pictures that they started the frame and in two weeks they built this whole like wood frame so we think it's gonna be done sooner than September hopefully hopefully it's like ready like September 1st and then we can literally just move out from our apartment and we don't have to pay like extra rent for another month but yeah guys that's the progress on our house let me know if you guys want to see keep seeing like the progress of our house and I'll make sure to record because we do come every Sunday and well now we've been coming Saturdays uh, like Saturday afternoons so let me know if you guys like to see this uh, if you guys like to see the progress and also let me know if you guys have questions because I know a lot of you want to buy a house out here so ask me in the comments anything you're wondering and I will for sure answer it for you guys but yeah I'm gonna end the vlog here so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I will see you guys on my next one